from the gateway to showbiz glory. This is Hollywood 411. The latest movie phenomenon is just days away from hitting theaters. It's Twilight, which is based on the best-selling vampire book series. The movie has already sold out hundreds of showings, according to online ticket seller Fandango, and it's already made two of its young actors huge stars. We sit down with them as part of our cram session for Twilight. When teen outcast Bella meets mysterious Edward, the attraction is magnetic, but there's just one problem. Out loud. Say it. Vampire. Are you afraid? No. The chemistry between the stars is magical, but director Catherine Hardwick wasn't always convinced that Robert Pattinson could carry the role. Their first phone call didn't help. It was about three o'clock in the morning, and I'd been out all night. <laughs> and she was like, what do you think about the character? I was like, oh, he's... He's just an animal. He's an animal. <laughs> I'm just going, it's the only thing I could talk about. But when Pattinson read for the role with Kristen Stewart, all doubts were removed. He was the only actor that came in to audition for the part that, that wasn't totally preoccupied with themselves. I mean, he was really looking at me. When he and Kristen got together and you started to see literally almost the sparks flying, that's when I thought, this is going to be good. And cut. Perfect. Twilight Movie Mania has already catapulted Stewart and Pattinson to superstardom, but it's only just starting to sink in. I've been in this like Twilight bubble all year, so I kind of I haven't gone back to my my real life yet. So I have no idea what it actually is. This isn't real. This kind of stuff just doesn't exist. It does in my world. A lot of times, you know, my brother or whoever will be like, you're an actor, you're just, you're just not real, you're acting. Like, yeah, but I had to live that. What if I'm not the hero? What if I'm the bad guy? I'm not. <laughs>